Oh, I wanted to film a look today and I was thinking of doing something that I do a lot like every day and it's this peachy look that I've really been liking. I've been really into this peach color because it's just really pretty. It's between like a brown and a pink and it's very wearable and I thought you guys would really like to recreate this look or like to see how I do it. So if you want to know how to recreate this peachy look, please keep watching and I will show you how. Okay guys, so first we're going to be priming the skin and I'm using my all-time favorite primer and this is by Becca. This is the Backlit Priming Perfector and I love this primer so, so much. It goes really great with this L'Oreal True Match foundation. I wear this foundation a lot. I love it and I always get asked what I'm wearing and this is definitely my favorite foundation from the drugstore. It's absolutely amazing. Then I'm going to be applying my L'Oreal Visible Lift Blur Concealer. I use the color Fair because it's just a really nice shade against my foundation and I'm just applying this in a highlighting motion. I'm just going to highlight the high points of my face and points of my face that I want to bring light to and then I like to blend this out with a beauty blender. And next I'm just going to set all those areas with my Kat Von D shade and light palette and I use the lightest shade in the palette to set those areas. And then I'm going to set my face with this Airspun Loose Face Powder. Next, I'm going to bronze up my skin with my Makeup Forever Pro Bronze Fusion. I use the darkest shade and I'm just going along the sides of my face and bringing some warmth to my complexion. Next, I'm going to take this Hoola Bronzer and I'm using my Kat Von D Shade and Light Brush. And I'm just doing a little bit of contouring with this and I just started trying this Hoola Bronzer out and I actually really love it. It's really soft and it's really, really nice. Next, I'm going to apply some blush. You can also use this L'Oreal blush. I'm using NARS Orgasm. I'm just going to highlight the apples of my cheeks with this blush, and then I'm going to highlight my cheekbones using Becca Pearl. Next, I'm just gonna fill in my eyebrows like I normally do. I always use the Anastasia Brow Duo for this, and I use the shade Medium Brown. I'm using a posh smudge and brow brush for this. Next, I'm gonna prime my lids and then I'm gonna go into this color called Millennial and I'm going to apply it to the crease of my eye and I'm using a Morphe E27 to do this. I love this color because it's really warm and it's just a really nice and bright transition shade. When doing a look like this, this color is just absolutely gorgeous when you use peach shades and just lighter shades. Next, I'm gonna go into the color called Selfie and I'm going to apply this to my lid. This is just a really pretty white, pinkish color. I just love the way it looks when you put it on the lid. It has a little sparkle to it, so I'm just going to pack this on. And then I'm going to take the color Chandelier and I'm applying this to my brow bone. I am then going to go back with a really fluffy brush and I'm going to blend this down into the crease so it's not so prominent. And I really like the highlighting effect this gives. Next, I'm going to apply some winged liner like I usually do, and I'm using my Kat Von D tattoo liner, and I absolutely love this eyeliner. I've talked about it so, so much, but I'm just winging it out like I usually do. Next, I'm gonna be taking the color Jackpot from the Stardust palette, and I'm using this on a pencil brush. And I'm just applying this to the outer V of my eye. This is gonna add some more depth to the look. Then I take a fluffy brush and I just blend that out some more. Next, I'm taking this Wet n Wild eyeliner, and this is in the shade Taupe of the Morning. This is just going to act as a little primer for when I go back in and apply it jackpot again on the lower lash line. And I'm using the same pencil brush I used before. I'm just applying this darker shade to the outer corner and bringing it inward. And then I went back in with the color Showgirl, which is a lot like jackpot, but it has more gold flecks in it. And I'm applying this to the inner corner of my eye and bringing it out. This just is a really nice contrast. And it adds a lot of lightness to the inner corner of your eye and a lot of gold undertones to the look. And I think it's just really pretty against the brown. Next, I'm going to apply this NYX white liner to my waterline. This is really gonna open up the eyes a lot. And I'm going to apply my favorite Ardell Demi Wispies to my lashes. These are really, really natural looking lashes that you could wear on a daily basis and they just look really nice with everyday looks. So I'm just going to apply some mascara to that and then I'm going to be applying MAC Double Time Lip Liner which is a really pretty peachy nude color. 
I'm just gonna line out my lips like I normally do. And I really like this lip liner because it is a pro long wear lip liner, so it's gonna stay on all day. Then I'm just gonna fill in my entire lips with this lip liner. This is also gonna help the lipstick stay a lot longer. Next, I'm going to apply this lipstick by YSL. This is Melon Dior. I discovered this lipstick this past weekend and it's really, really pretty. It actually kind of is so pigmented that it looks like an eyeshadow when you apply it. It's just so gorgeous and it's a really pretty peach color. And then I'm gonna set the rest of my face with MAC Fix Plus. All right guys, thank you so much for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in my next tutorial.